okay, mate. We don't want to spook the fish, okay? So be careful. Oh no. Snag. Getting careless. My cast. This sucks because I only have so many hours of daylight today. So I'm wasting my time. Fighting with the tree. First rule of finding fish is go where the people aren't. So the fishy hole up there has been vacated. Sweet. Tangled my fly line up here like this. Oh, there was one. Wasn't able to set it. I do a little something called a roll cast. The bridge is behind me, a little hard to cast. Snag. That one's gonna be tough to get my fly back with from. That one I'm gonna have to give up. So hopefully I lose the the fly. Broke the hook point off of that guy. New fly. I'm gonna switch to a fly that I tied. Looks a little botched. Ain't pretty, but it's uh. We'll let's see if it does a trick. I noticed that some of them work and some of them don't. So. Yep. He rose at my line. There's another one. Maybe they don't like the nymph. I'll have to switch to some dries. Yeah. There's a boulder under the water there and I think they hang out by it. Oh, did you see it? I'm gonna switch to dries. Cause they're rising like right in front of me. Back in the box. I'm gonna try this purple haze. I think people just are interested in how fly fishing works. So this is a great way for them to experience it. And from my perspective, I'm not a very good fly fisherman. I'm not like world class, A game fly fisher guy. But I've gotten to the point where I can kind of catch fish. So then that means it's fun. Yeah, you just got to pay attention to what your line is doing. So this one's. Oh, did you see that? That was a take, first cast. Yep. Now just take a look. Either I was too slow or he spit it out too early. So don't forget to, if you catch a fish, always rub its nose. Yeah, we got, we'll talk about that when I catch one here, okay? And you can rub its nose. Uh, I had one bite 
on the nymph too. So there's fish here. Oh, I got one. Oh, he's a little guy. There we go. No, we don't keep them as pets. They belong in the wild. All right. Wild fish. Yep, this is a. That's a tiny, tiny bowl. Yep. Tiny, tiny so bowl. We wash our hands. Only, We're gentle with the fish. I only uh, wet So you my can hands. see that he took that fly in his mouth. Take it out and then I'll rub his nose and he'll be on his merry way. Okay, a tool called a oh. Oh. I have a tool called a hemostat. That's gonna help me get this hook out because I it's kind of ah, lodged squirming. in there extra pretty good. Stop squirming. I wanna rub your nose so you won't call your friends. Did you wash your hands? Get your hands wet. Oh, wet my fingers. Oh, slippery son of a gun. So you can see this is a cutthroat. He's got a little mark on his jaw. I'll name it. He's juvenile. You can see his spots. So are you going to rub his nose? Yeah. Okay, rub his nose. Oh, jeez, Louise, he wants to bite you. Rub his nose. Where's his nose at? Right there. We rub a fish's nose because it helps them forget that they just got caught. Bye, Cuddy. All right, got one fish. Even if it's just a tiny one, it's a lot of fun. Oh, yanked him across the dang river. Don't count. So this is a clinch knot. I got the fly flying through there and I just pinched the fly. This is your tag end, the loose end here. I just wrap it around seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then at the base there, there's going to be a little loop right next to the eye of the hook. And you just take your tag end and slip it through that hole. And then you hold the end of it. And then you got to spit on it. Just put it in my mouth. When you pull that knot tight, the friction can weaken the knot or weaken the leader. So a little spit keeps it from getting too hot make sure our knot stays strong so if those fish bite on this is floatant it's a chemical that uh, increases the buoyancy of the of the fly and helps it keep it from retaining water but I think the loom company there they they go out of their way to making environmentally friendly chemicals. On this one I can kind of see a barb on so I'm gonna I'm gonna try to work that off. And we're back in business. I saw a fish rise over here. So I kind of want to get him. But I'm having a hard time seeing the fly. Oh, he's right there. Jump right in front of me, huh? 